Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at practicalplants.org. It's a collaboratively edited encyclopedia of different types of plants. In other words, it's a sort of a Wikipedia for plants. Now, I have done permaculture plant lists in the past, and there are several different sites out there, and they do list a few of them down here. Plants for a Future is a good one, and uh, BioWiki Farm, another decent one, although I haven't checked that out in a little bit. This has a lot of good features. We're going to go to the nitrogen fixing page in just a second, but they do offer searches based on soil type, based on the sun preference, shade preference, the hardiness zone, the canopy, and they're about to fix the uh, search page so it has uses, a uses category. Down here at the bottom, edible uses, material uses, medicinal uses, and functions. Now some of these don't have uh, plants listed yet. They are hoping to build a community of other permaculture enthusiasts and plant enthusiasts to help build up the functionality of this website. But what's really valuable is their nitrogen fixer page. So we're going to go to there and it just shows the A. So what you want to do is click on further results and then click on the 500 to get the complete list. Now they have 443 different nitrogen fixing plants, otherwise known as legumes. So these plants have a symbiotic relationship with a type of soil bacteria and it takes nitrogen from the atmosphere and puts it into a form that can be easily uptaken by the plant's roots. Now the atmosphere is about 70% nitrogen and about 30% oxygen with some trace gases like carbon dioxide and such. So uh, since plants require nitrogen as to, for above ground leafy growth and photosynthesis, it's really the one nutrient that plants love and need the most. Having nitrogen fixing plants growing next to other plants can really help benefit all the plants around it because that beneficial bacteria is going to take nitrogen from the atmosphere and put in the soil for all the plants to use. And they also have a polyculture page for the three sisters, which is a great example of this. So you have a uh, ground cover, which is a squash. Then you have a uh, bean, which is a uh, vine type bean usually, and that's the nitrogen fixer. And then you have a corn that allows a sort of a stalk for the beans to grow up. So you can plant three different crops in a small space. Now Native Americans have also found that you really want to have some fish meal or as the Native Americans use a fish head to help really grow the system, help have it thrive with the nutrients it really needs besides just the nitrogen. Well I am going to link to the Practical Plants main page, practicalplants.org, and their nitrogen fixing page. If you'd like to see more news headlines like this, subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.